start your prayer by removing barrier between your heart and the Spirit of God. And what are the barriers? Somebody might have hurt you in one way and the other. Somebody might have cheated you in one way and the other. Somebody might have embarrassed you in one way or the other. And the Bible says, whether you are right or wrong, you have no right to hold what? To hold offense. Because it's your counselor, it's your deliverer, it's your commander, it's the one fighting for you. You can't fight for yourself. If anybody offends you, leave it for God. God will fight the person. So you now to take it upon yourself and begin to hold offense, you want to fight. Whether you are right or wrong, you have no right. You have no right. You are not given permission to hold offense. By the time you remove this barrier, your heart will be free. Because the Bible says, a free spirit attracts the spirit of God. If your heart is not free, it cannot attract the spirit of God. Your heart needs to be free. Right now, viewers all over the world, open your list, say, Lord, I want to be released. Viewers all over the world, between your heart and the Spirit of God, whatever barrier needs to be removed. Barrier could be offense, could be pain of the past, bitterness, jealousy, envy. Right now, it is time to remove them by confessing them and ask God to help you. Confess them and ask God to help you. How do we confess them? We confess them when we confess with all our hearts. They was at home. Confess your release. Begin to confess your release. Confess your release with all your heart. You are released in the name of Jesus. I say be released in the name of Jesus. I say be released in the name of Jesus. The Lord said to me, T.B. Joshua, look at the heart of your people. Look at the heart of your people. Look at the heart of your people, viewers at home, viewers all over the world, anywhere you are, I can see your heart. You have to be released in the name of Jesus. You have to be released in the name of Jesus. Listen, the Lord said to me, TV Joshua, look at the heart of your people. I can see your heart being released. I can see your heart being released in the name of Jesus. Release from bitterness. Release from bitterness, jealousies, anger, hatred, resentment. Be released in the name of Jesus. Whatever Satan might have used to connect you to himself, I disconnect you. That Satan you to connect you, I disconnect you. That Satan you to connect your career, to connect your career, your children, your destiny, I disconnect you in the name of Jesus. I disconnect you in the name of Jesus. That Satan you to connect your country, your community, your health, your good health. That Satan you to connect them. I disconnect him. Be disconnected. Be disconnected. Be disconnected. Be disconnected. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. Rejoice. Listen to me. I can see your heart be released. I can see your heart be released. I can see your spirit be released. It's over to you now. You just confess your release and say, Thank you, Jesus, and believe you are released. And believe with all your heart you are released. There are some offense you don't know. There are some barrier you don't know. Ignorantly, you may not know that this is the hindrance. This is the barrier. Knowingly or unknowingly, you are released. 
You are released. You are released. When you are not released from this barrier, whom are you talking to? You can't talk to Heavenly Father. It may, whatever you are going to say, you say it to the air. You just talk to the air. Be here, be here. You are talking to yourself? Be here, be here. You are talking to the air. It's very important, very, very important prayer. You have to be convinced and you have to believe you are released. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Merci, Jesus. The barrier between your heart and the Spirit of God, I can see it being removed. Amen. Yeah. But you have not seen it. But I have seen it. How will you see it now? By believing what I said. Amen. That's so simple. Amen. Are you with me? If a man is on the wheelchair, and I say, be healed in Jesus' name, and I say, I can see you be healed, and the man I have not seen himself be healed, so how would this man know? By just take my word. And say, ah, this man said it. Let him follow what he said, not what I believe. By the time he follow what I say, he would realize that, oh, yes, he have seen this before me. So you have been released. Yeah. If you call them God, from whom the word of God came, the scripture, the Bible, cannot be broken. Take this. Right now, before we start, I can see you being released. Yeah. I repeat again. I can see you being released. Yeah. I can see you being released. Yeah. Are you saying this amen from your heart? Yes. And you believe you are released? Yes. You believe you are released? Yes. Let us go. Now we want to break every yoke. Because you can talk to God right now. And God also can talk to you. The barrier has been removed. You can talk now. Get ready to talk. And you have to talk with all your heart. You mean what you say. And God mean what is said to you. Right now, open your lips. Every familiar spirit that tormented your way. Every familiar spirit that disturb you. Every familiar spirit that cause you, that cause you pain, that cause you loss, that cause you failure, that cause you sickness, that cause you setback. Begin to rebook them right now. Todo espíritu familiar que está causando depresión, que está causando dolor, aflicción, hoy se ha removido en el nombre de Jesús. Comment ça Je sais tous les esprits familiers qui vous perturbent. Brisez tous les jours dans le nom de Jésus-Christ. Continuez à prier dans le nom de Jésus-Christ. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ. You just have to mean it and say it with all your heart. When you say something with all your heart, your mouth is not needed, but your heart. This familiar spirit, they cause pain. This familiar spirit, they cause setback. This familiar spirit, they cause failure. I mean, this familiar spirit cause limitation in progress. Familiar spirit. Familiar spirit. Familiar spirit. Open your lips right now and begin to remove them on your way and cause them right now prayer. Continuez de prier, demandez à tous les esprits familiers de sortir de vos voies, continuez à les maudire dans le nom de Jésus Christ. Libérez-vous et chassez-les, tous les esprits familiers dans votre vie dans le nom de Jésus Christ. Ahora mismo, televidente, únase a la oración masiva y ora en contra. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ. You familiar spirit, you cause my people pain. You cause them challenges. You cause them limitation. You cause them familiar spirit. Right now, we cause you right now to live in the name of Jesus. We cause you to live in the name of Jesus. 
live in the name of Jesus. This familiar spirit, they cause sickness, they cause disease, they cause disease. I say you familiar spirit, you familiar spirit. Open your list, open your list, open your list. Whatever this familiar spirit must have cost you, his name is Demon. His name is Demon. His name is Demon. His name is Satan. His name is Destruction. His name is Killer. You familiar spirit, we say to you, whatever you cost them, go out, go out, go out, go out with your sickness, out with your disease, out with your failure, out with your setback, out with your nightmare, out with your disease, with your failure, with your limitation, with your limitation, with your Ahora mismo, televidente, una sea la oración masiva y hecha para todo espíritu de limitación, de retroceso que está estancando su vida en el nombre de Jesús. Que que sea el nombre que vos donéis al demon, que sea el destructor, que sea el demon que vos afligís. En el nombre de Jesús. Como de la sofía en el nombre de Jesús Cristo. Cuando you know the power you are under, it may help your faith. It will increase your faith. Regardez votre écran. Regardez autour de vous. Les spectateurs, soyez conscients de la puissance sur laquelle vous êtes. Regardez autour de vous. Regardez votre écran. Regardez ce qui se passe. Et soyez conscients de la puissance sur laquelle vous êtes. mighty name of Jesus Christ. Right now, whatever Satan must have used to connect you to himself, it could be your word, it could be your character, it could be your attitude, it could be your way, Satan can use our word to connect us to himself. Maybe you talk arrogantly, you talk hate, you talk pride, you talk offense, you belittle people. Satan will use that to connect you to himself. Whatever Satan must have used to connect you to himself, right now begin to disconnect yourself. Disconnect yourself. Disconnect yourself. Disconnect yourself. Disconnect yourself. Disconnect yourself. Begin to disconnect yourself. Disconnect yourself. She lived between us. I give her her temper. She has no shame in any court. She has no fear. In 
the mighty name of Jesus Christ. I disconnect you from that. Satan used to connect you. I disconnect you from that. Satan used to connect you. I disconnect 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 you. That Satan used to connect you. I disconnect you. Be disconnected. 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 Begin to disconnect your finances, your ministry, your household. Disconnect your head. Disconnect your country, your family. Disconnect your children. Desconectate, desconecta tu familia, desconecta tus finanzas, desconecta tu ministerio, ahora, en el nombre de Jesús. Baby, she just give her that kitty, baby. Viva is great. I connect with witches, wizard. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Reconciliese. I am the great Lucifer. Right now, confess your freedom. I'm disconnected. I'm disconnected. My finances have been disconnected. My ministry has been disconnected. My business has been disconnected. My family has been disconnected. My career has been disconnected. Give thanks to God. Mi familia ha sido desconectada. Dele gracias a Dios. ¿Dónde está Dios? Dios, watch this channel. Why? Why? I wanted them to separate. Ah. Let us go into your head. Let's go to your blood. Let's go to your faculties. Let's go into your organ. Every unwanted, every sickness disease in your organ, wherever in your muscle, wherever in your kidney, wherever in your blood, wherever in your tender, in your bone, begin to flush it out by the power of Holy Ghost, by the blood of Jesus and power of Holy Ghost. Flush them out, flush them out, flush them out. You sickness in my bone, you disease in my bone, you sickness in my kidney, you disease in my liver, you sickness in my blood, you disease in my fluid, you sickness in my bone, you disease in my body, in my organ, begin to flush them out, flush them out, flush them out. El evidente empieza a lavar, empieza a lavarse con la sangre de Cristo, por el poder del Espíritu Santo, en su, en su cuerpo, toda enfermedad en su cuerpo, en sus órganos, en sus huesos. Ahora empieza a ser lavado en el nombre de Jesús. If barrier has been moved between your heart and the Spirit of God, talk to God. The words all over the world. Where can we go from His presence? Barrier between your heart and the Spirit of God has been removed. Since the barrier has been removed between your heart and the Spirit of Father, talk to God. Talk to God. As it shall be given, now it shall be open right now. Wherever that sickness in your organ. In your blood, so, in your flu, in, in your tender, in your kidney, in your liver, in your blood, in your flu. Right now, begin to command them out by the power of Holy Ghost, the power of Jesus, blood of Jesus. Flood them out, 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 flood them out. The ones all over the world, are you sick? Whatever name they call it, it's infirmity. I command that sickness to leave you in the name of Jesus. I command that sickness to leave you in the name of Jesus. Wherever that sickness is in your organ, in your organ, in your organ, I command them out in the name of Jesus. I command them out in the name of Jesus. I command them out in the name of Jesus. Listen, Viva, believe it, 
I can see you being healed. You believe it? Hmm. Listen once again. I can see you being healed. Hmm. I can see you being delivered. Right now, pray for your nation. Pray for your country. Flag of your country. Your nature be redeemed in the name of Jesus. Be redeemed in the name of Jesus. Your leader be redeemed in the name of Jesus. Open your lips and begin to pray for your nation, your country. Pray for your country, your nation. Pray for your leader. Ore por su nación, ore por sus líderes. Misappropriation, idolatry, killing, stealing, destruction. Ask God to release your nation. Demandez a Dieu de libérer votre nation. Priez pour les dirigeants. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ. I want you to lift up your voice. The name of your country. Christ to God for salvation. Cry to God for redemption. Cry to God. Child the name of your nation. Child. I can hear you. Again. Again. I can hear you. I can hear you. Once again. Again and again. Ask for redemption. Là où que vous criez pour votre nation, demandez à Dieu pour sa rédemption. Empiece a clamar por su nation. Grite le nom de su nation. Empiece a redimir su nation. In Jesus Christ's name, we pray. Amen. Every nation has so much concern. Just as what is happening in all other nations. Our nation has a sport. Open your lips once again and cry to God. the father of nations, the father of continents, cry to him to redeem our nation, our continent, our country. Prayer. Ore por su nación. Ore por sus líderes. Ore en esa, en esa misma hora, televidente. Conéctese con esa oración. La distancia no es una barrera. Ore en el nombre de Jesús. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ, I want everyone to go on their knee for your country, continent, and your nation and cry to God for redemption. Now, it's everywhere. Todos vayan a su Dry boat shall rise again. Yeah. There's no single nation without challenges. And the challenge is causing opera. Right now, open your lips and say to Lord, here we are on our knee with humility, with all our heart. I pray for my nation. I pray for country. I pray for continent. And I pray for nations all over. Trouble one. Father, come and intervene. Come and intervene. Come at this time and intervene. Ven ahora mismo televidentes sobre sus rodillas. 
Levante una oración a su nación, de que el Espíritu del Padre venga a intervenir en su nación. Señor, que nos estamos ayunando, nos prions, Señor, que tú puedas restaurar. God's intervention, God's intervention in the whole world. God's intervention, God's intervention. We need God's intervention in the whole world. Intervention. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Don't forget rescued nations. They too are facing their own challenges. Remember them in prayer, especially in the United States. Open your list for prayer. Nation that helps nations. They too are facing challenges now. Let God come down and rescue and put peace among the people. Pour les nations qui secourent d'autres nations, prions pour les spécialement les États-Unis d'Amérique. God's intervention, God's intervention in America. God's intervention. We need God's intervention in America. Intervention. Intervention. We need God's intervention in America. Jesus. Oh, Lord. Glory be 
to God Almighty. Don't forget the nature of Nigeria. There is peace. That is why we are here today. Pray for the leaders and the nation. Thank you. Hallelujah. In Jesus Christ's name we pray. Amen. Hallelujah. Thank you very much. Rise up. Thank you. Give glory to God. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Yes, I want to tell you your effort, your love, you show today shall be returned by God. Yeah. Rejoice.